security now. Gunmen have abducted two health workers and patients from the primary health care center in Beningwari, local government area of Kaduna State. According to reports, the suspected bandits initially targeted the nearby Government Day Secondary School on Monday, expecting it to have resumed. Finding the school deserted, they turned their attention to the closest healthcare facility. Chairman of the Beningwari Ninja Interboundary Group of Rural Communities, Isha Katsai, explained that two community health extension workers and multiple patients were kidnapped, leaving the community in fear and uncertainty. Chairman of the Beningwari Ninja Interboundary Group of Rural Communities, Ishak Kasai, joins me on the news at 10 for more updates on the incident. Good to have you join us. Quite unfortunate, um, the, the circumstances you know, under which we're speaking, but what's the latest you can tell us now about this particular incident? Thank you for having me. Well, uh, you know, the issue of uh, you know, today's attack uh, well, it has been uh, catastrophic because uh, really, initially, what they, they target is not the health facility actually that, that they targeted. They targeted the government, the secondary school, because they thought that maybe based on the wrong information that they may have, that the school, you know, public schools are actually resuming today. So when they jumped to the secondary school, around that between 10 to you know 11 a.m in the morning so they check the school and they could not find anyone therefore they moved to the you know nearby health clinic and then kidnap you know uh, community health workers in the primary health care center of you know uh Puyallo community in the eastern part of binungwari well which is uh, actually located along the you know binungwari funtua Highway, so that is where uh, actually the uh, you know kidnapped up the the, the, the health care workers, two health care workers as well as two other patients patients that they found there in the health clinic. And as you know that you know uh, Kuyalo actually is sharing boundary with notorious you know Zampara, that is Kuyambana Forest as well as Kamuku Forest, which is in Kaduna. Then the Kuyambana Forest is there in the you know under. Zampara uh, under more local government area of Zampara state. So therefore, the bandits usually come from that particular area and then mm. towards Niger. Well, uh, Mr. Kasai, come, if yeah, I may quickly yes. come in, um, you're speaking to the vulnerability of the area because of the boundaries that it shares with other states that are also experiencing similar situation. But I wanted to ask you if um, you have heard anything you know, about the whereabouts of those who were taken and then what is the situation now in terms of um, the presence of security agencies? Well, well, the situation where uh, about of the, our people, we know normally whenever they took, you know, people, kidnapped people from Binungwari area, even around Niger, they, you know, where they used to go and keep them is somewhere around, you know, Zampara area. So I think the major problem is Zampara state. Even where Eva Zampara actually share boundary, what you will see the problem is there. When you talk about Kasuna, where Kasuna is having problem with the you know issue of this criminality, you will see it share border is where it share border with Zampara state. The same thing with Sokoto, you will see eastern part of Sokoto share border with Zampara. That is where they are having problems. So therefore, it is something with major state. So as well as Kaduna State. So we know where they are taking it to is, you know, around the, you know, Kuyambana Forest, which is around Maru, local government area. And we know, uh, you know, you know, Dogo Jeti, as well as one Kachala, uh, Halil Malan, is where they are based in that's around Maru, uh, uh, when, uh, uh, around Maru, local government area of Zampara, particularly area around Kansado. So we know that is where mm -hmm. our people usually been taken to. All right, thank you so much for your time and um, our, condol our condolences and rather sympathies with you and your community, Mr. Thank Isha you. Kasai. Thank you for having me. Thank you very much.